Hey folks, welcome to the quick book review, your one-stop shop for book summaries in this video we summarize the book India's Struggle for Independence a comprehensive and detailed account of India's independence movement against British colonial rule. Written by the late historian Bipan Chandra, the book covers the period from 1857 to 1947, tracing the evolution of the national movement and the various events and individuals that contributed to India's eventual independence. The author provides a nuanced and balanced view of the various strands of the independence movement, including the role of leaders such as Mahatma Gandhi, Jawaharlal Nehru and Bhagat Singh, as well as regional leaders and movements. He also provides a detailed analysis of the impact of colonialism on India, including the impact of economic, social and political policies on Indian society. The book delves into the different phases of the independence movement, including the early struggle for constitutional reforms, the non-cooperation movement, the civil disobedience movement, and the Quit India movement. The author also provides an in-depth examination of the partition of India, which led to the creation of independent India and Pakistan. In short, India's struggle for independence is a comprehensive and insightful account of India's journey to freedom. In his book India's Struggle for Independence, Historian Bipan Chandra provides a comprehensive overview of the events leading up to and including India's independence from British rule. The author covers the various political, social and economic factors that influenced the independence movement and its leaders. Chandra examines the role of key figures such as Mohandas Gandhi, Jawaharlal Nehru and Subhas Chandra Bose in shaping the independence movement and the strategies they employed in their struggle for independence. In addition to discussing the independence movement, Chandra also delves into the broader historical context of British rule in India and its impact on Indian society. He examines the British policies and administration that led to widespread poverty and exploitation, and the cultural and religious changes brought about by British rule. The author also provides a detailed analysis of the events leading up to the partition of India in 1947 and the challenges faced by the newly formed Indian government in the aftermath of independence. Chandra concludes by highlighting the legacy of the independence movement and the challenges faced by India in the post-independence era. Overall, the book provides a comprehensive and nuanced look at India's struggle for independence and its historical context. With its focus on the political, social and economic factors that shaped the independence movement, it provides valuable insights for anyone interested in the history of India and its independence from British rule. In conclusion, by Pan Chandra's India's struggle for independence is an extensive and insightful work that provides a comprehensive account of the Indian independence movement. The author has meticulously researched the subject and presents a clear and nuanced understanding of the complexities of the struggle against British rule. The book covers a wide range of events, personalities and movements, and provides a detailed analysis of the socio-economic, political and cultural context of the time. This is a must-read for anyone interested in the history of India's independence and the broader context of colonialism and anti-colonialism in the world. The book is well written, accessible, and provides a balanced and nuanced understanding of a critical period in India's history. Thanks for watching. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our channel. We have a lot of exciting summaries coming up and we don't want you to miss out. By subscribing, you'll be the first to know when we release a new video. Don't forget to like and share if you enjoyed the video. We look forward to seeing you in our next summary.